right. I just got finished. Oh, we just we just got finished uh, driving for dollars. Um, and we we found one fisbo. That's the GPS. So you gotta excuse that. But we found we found one fisbo, and it was nice too. Four bedroom. Um, to uh, a double wide mobile home, four bedroom, huge mobile home. I mean, the bedroom, every bedroom was like was like looked like a master bedroom. It seemed like you was kind. It's kind of confusing which was the master bedroom because they was all so big, big old backyard. It was like on a corner, so so they had the uh, the big backyard. You know, um, not really. A, well, yeah, front yard, kind of a front. Yeah, pretty much a big front yard, too. Um, they got a little chicken coop that they built. So that's going to come with the house, too. They ain't going to take the chicken coop with them. Um, they probably take the chickens more than likely. But big backyard, nice big house, laundry room, all kind of extra rooms. And it was just it was huge. It was huge. That's probably one of the biggest I've been in so far. It was kind of older. Might have been 89 or something like that. Maybe even 85. But they took real, very good care of it. They did a lot of things into the, in the mobile home as far as the kitchen. And I think the bathroom, all of the kitchen floor was they did since they've been in there. So I don't know what they want. I got to call the uh, um, number back from the for sale sign. I, got, I called the number and the young lady told me she wasn't home but her mom was there. So I was like, well, can I see it now? See, we used to wait and make appointments, but now because we're trying to do, uh, a, you know, a substantial amount of appointments every week, um, because a lot of it is a number game, you know. So the more appointments you make, the more appointments you go on, the more offers you put in, um, the more chance you have a, a, of getting some um, of getting some deals, somebody to, to agree with your offer, you know. And of course, you got to be nice and courteous and polite, you know. Um, in this business, we you know we learning it that it's not just a numbers game. It's also it's a people's game, you know. As we you know as we as we know, it's like in mobile home investing. You're not a you're not a uh, in the in the real estate business. They say they say you're in the people business, and that's that's really any business really. But in mean, this particular business right here, you know, you really have to. Uh, I mean, the good thing about it, you know, is that. Many people have a natural kindness about them, you know, um, you know, generally, you know, you got some people out here that's just buttholes, but generally people got a nice and myself personally, that's my first. That's just my personality. So it's not I don't have to I don't have to fake like I'm being nice to nobody. You know what I'm saying? I don't have to do that. It's just natural for me to have a everybody I meet pretty much have a clean slate. You know what I'm saying? And I just uh, let people burn their own bridge, you know. So with this mobile home investing, it's easy for me when it comes to the people part. It's pretty easy for the most part. So anyway, we've seen that one. I'm going to call her back probably in a little while. I'll probably give her a call back in the next 30 minutes or so and ask her what the price is. And I took a bunch of pictures. So I'll send them over to my partners. If you don't have